Hear my words. If you would seek great riches, there is a mysterious chest in the oasis. It holds a wonder of the ancient coin, but it's sealed to us by a powerful hex. Find it if you would break the curse. <laughs> Chest opener doomed us all. Ugh. What were you thinking, you ignorant cur? And who are you to speak to me that way? You likely know of me. I am Garrett of Trivia, hunter of monsters, slayer of demons, kisser of witches. I protect this world for money. And now you have released true evil upon it. I was just looking for loot. And instead, you have released the spirit of Celissa, the evil coiled water goddess. Now her foulness will corrupt the local desert coiled, turning them into bloodthirsty thralls. See? Here they come. I'll be back in a second. Celissa! Took you long enough. Come here. Sure, <laughs> we have to clean up your mess before Celissa condemns the coil to perpetual rage and fury. Or worse, decides to drown the entire world. Head to Celissa's eternal wellspring up ahead. Walking is for peasants, so I'll uh, meet you there. <clears throat> you know, there's actually a prophecy about all this. It says the first seal will be broken by a bumbling, foolhardy fool. That's you, by the way. I'm getting the sense this uh, is very nice. Nope, he is. So what's got cranky pants pants all cranky anyway? So, some people are just me. Again. Um, Garrett of Trivia, the most famous and prolific monster player in all the land. Thousands of abominations dead by my hand. Come on, me. Bards sing of my legendary deeds. Oh, yeah? Name one. I once bedded a woman while mounted in the corner. Logistically, uh, that seems difficult. <laughs> I know, right? I'm busy fighting real monsters at the moment, so clear out this fodder while I finish up. See that? That's what's left of Celissa. Reduced to her pure primordial creative essence. This orb, this prison, provides water to the entire oasis. She was reduced to this state by the first viziers during the torrent of treachery. But by releasing Celissa's spirit, you put not only the Oasis, but the entire world at risk. Our only course is to reunite her three shattered aspects, so we can revive her, then slay her. Alright, so we're gonna stop her by freeing her. And just hope that we can kill an evil goddess? Uh, we have to do this before she recovers the full extent of her power. But I wouldn't expect someone without my level of experience to know that. So go. You have to finish what you started. You'll need the still warm life hearts of Silas's most ferocious creations, the Sea Wargs. Once you've done that, we'll work toward freeing Silas's physical form. As for me, I'll be uh, fighting other monsters and gathering reagents for oils and potions and things uh, to prepare for the fight with Salissa. So you're on your own, which means shut up and leave me alone. Damn, Tino, why'd you make this guy such a jerk face? Hey, not everybody's sunshine and candy balls, Val. Some people's got issues. He's one of them. He could be less of a jerk face, though. Yeah, he could, but he's not gonna. Finally. 
Now find the Everfrost ice tube in which her physical form is imprisoned. It is a perilous road that you must travel. First, <laughs> head toward... I don't need directions. I have a map marker. You have... a sight? Um... yes? But that takes years of training. <laughs> Maybe I misjudged you. Maybe. But probably not. <clears throat> Watch yourself. The coil here will likely also be hostile. Because of what you did. You earlier with the chest. Which wouldn't be a problem if you were as good a fighter as I am. <laughs> Found the ice tomb. Now what am I supposed to do with these arms? Oh, I forgot that you're an illiterate child who doesn't understand the prophecy. Bury the hearts, you simpleton. Honestly, how did you manage to cause so much damage while knowing so little about anything? Ooh, what's going on? Fine. Now, according to the prophecy, you must acquire the battle standards of the Elder Coil Vizians. For they are the direct blood descendants of the first Vizians who imprisoned Sylvissa many years ago. Just so you know, you're so damn lucky I showed up. Because I'm the only one who can tell you how to fix this thing that you've totally screwed up with your bumbling and common. What's a charmer, that one? I don't know. He's actually kind of growing up. Are you serious? Yeah, I mean, there's something about that no-nonsense gruff demeanor. It's weirdly charming. I don't know why. Yeah, me neither. Ah. Place the standards so they interrupt the primary ley lines feeding the Ice Tomb's enchantment. The ice is primed. Now shatter it and free Solis's physical form. Solis's form will now begin reconstituting in the throne room. Next, we must free her mind. I have tracked it to the shrine of the goddesses. So go there. Now. <coughs> And i join you, but I've got, like, a lot going on right now, you know. Monsters. Slaying monsters, collecting reagents, bedding women, slaying more monsters, you get it. Welcome, Traveler, to the Shrine of the Goddesses. I wish to enter. All are welcome here. Please, follow me. of the Shrine of the Goddesses, once known as the Traitor's Prison. Here, the four elemental locks are united in keeping the mind of wicked Salissa imprisoned within her statue. Could you, uh, stop them from doing that? Surely you jest. Salissa's imprisonment keeps us safe and prosperous. How dare you even joke about such things? Now, if you're quite through with your tomfoolery, then please, feel free to tour the facility. I have some work to attend to. You're in? Uh, finally. The prophecy says your next task is taking a leap of faith into the darkness. Even you couldn't mess that up, right? You didn't mess that <laughs> up. Although I would have landed more gracefully. Now you must find the elemental crystals, which are the keys to unlock Salissa's mind prison. Obviously. Don't make me repeat myself. All right. 
Look, as much as I just adore holding your hand through all of this, I've got beautiful women to sleep with and jealous husbands to avoid. Just follow the sight and figure it out. One down, three to go. I say this because at this point I assume you don't know simple math. Ah. What was that, Delilah? Oh, no, no. It's just some rube who would have doomed the world without my help. Oh, you're right. I am pretty heroic. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> according to the prophecy, the fire crystal has gone missing. You have no idea what doom you herald. It will mean death to the world, should you proceed. <clears throat> oh, she probably has it. I will guard the fire crystal <clears throat> with my life. Whatever, kill her. Oh, it's like a knife, don't it? Might have lived if you run. It's time to deactivate the locks up above. <laughs> that is, if you can figure out how to get back. Those crystals you gathered should unlock the seals. And as much as it pains me to admit this, I'm not sure what happens after that. That is Aspheria, goddess of sand. She is known as the Judge, and her mighty mace, Shatterfist, is both her weapon and her gavel. It was she who passed judgment upon Celissa's many sins. What do you think you're doing? <clears throat> this is madness! Gentle Tibitha, goddess of air, who wields the great bow Skypiercer. So named because it is said that she created the constellations by shooting holes in the night sky. Don't you place one more crystal, or I'll be forced to shout at you again! Ah, Hephasia, goddess of fire, wielder of the flame whip, Lashfe. It was she who lit the flame of consciousness in the coiled and brought our society out of the darkness. What insanity is possessing you? I'm begging you, please stop! Wicked Salissa, goddess of water, wielder of the legendary Bident, tied sorrow. After Asphyria passed judgment upon Salissa, she formed an alliance with Hephaestia and Tibitha to grant a share of their power to the first viziers who shattered Salissa and imprisoned her mind in this very shrine. What have you done? Alyssa's mind has taken control of that librarian or whatever. That's a shame. See if she's, uh, you know, Salissa now. Uh, curator? Ugh, what disgusting body are we in? Regardless, it's absolutely hilarious that you are attempting to bring us back. <laughs> Love that for us. Anyway, catch us if you can. <laughs> Better not let this body die. She seems so innocent. But we've got places to be. Don't let her out of your sight! The prophecy says she must reach the point of ascension. <laughs> this is a delight. Mortals are all so stupid. <laughs> but especially you. <laughs> How? Is this really all you're doing? It's just, you don't look like the hunter type. Or even very tough at all. No! Trapped in my own mind! Celissa controlling my body! L listen to me! You must stop this or else she'll... Stop 
fish died nice. This is pretty messed up right here. Uh, I would rather be copulating on a unicorn, if I'm being honest. Thanks again for your help, idiot mortal. We can feel the locks upon our mind unlatching, which means we're done with this body. See you again soon. <laughs> That's a shame. You know, she would have been fine if you hadn't doomed us all. So that one's really on you. See that? Solissa's power is returning. But there is one more task before we can fully resurrect her. We must now focus all her aspects into one, using the legendary weapon Tide Sorrow. Solissa's Bident. Bident? Yes, like a trident, but two. Try to keep up. Let your magical sight lead the way to the labyrinth of no escape and also endless torment. Uh-huh. Go on. <clears throat> the history of the labyrinth is lengthy and impressive. <clears throat> it is said that in order to retrieve the key to enter, you must... Uh, uh, must what? Must what? Oh, crabbity 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 crab crab crab. Yeah, so, uh, I was playtesting my campaign, and in this part of the quest, I had players shoot the sun to get the labyrinth key, but it just wasn't working because nobody thought to look up, but then I got sleepy and I forgot to replace the task. Well, what the hell are we supposed to do now? Hey, baby, it's cool. It's all good. I can hang on my feet. Just get to the, uh, the labyrinth of no escape and also endless. Even the prophecy doesn't know where the ancient keystone is gone. You will have to find it. Well, that was quick. Now, to open the door, you must recite the following exactly Clotunamius Baradadum Nictorium. <clears throat> okay. Krampus. Birdie, uh, Nippledum. That was terrible. You definitely summoned the guardians within, who will definitely kill you. Nice one. If by some miracle you survive, find the Bident. So the long lost keystone was like 10 feet away, and all we had to do was recite some gibberish nonsense words? Shut up, Valentine. <gasps> words have power, you big dumb idiot moron. Ouch. Yeah, I guess they do. Have waited so, so long. Mm. Sounds like the ancient demon fiend and queen of Atlantis, the Heart Phage. Sorry, the what? Oh, you heard me. I thirst. Huh? Thanks for all the help with that fight, Mike. Shut up. Just take the bite of By the way, it's very, very cursed. <gasps> Pretty sure I mentioned that. Anyway, I'll meet you back at Solissa's eternal wellspring. Don't <gasps> delay. Now that Solissa's three aspects have been released, she will begin reconstituting within her primordial essence of creation. Once we bring the Bident to the location of the shattering ritual, it will resurrect her. <gasps> I guess I'll give you the honor of fighting beside me, but hear me when I say this. Do not get in my way. Uh, took you long enough. But at least I had time to drink my potions and oil my blades. Now we head to the room uh, where the shattering ritual was performed. Uh, Are you ready to bear witness to the greatest monster slayer of all time at the top of his game? Me, I mean. Place the Bident into the pedestal and prepare yourself. Hear me, wicked son! 
Melissa. It is I, the undefeated monster slayer, Garrett of Trivia. Hear my name well, for it will be the last thing you hear. I stand ready to prove to the world that even a goddess can bleed. <laughs> Wow, you're really as stupid as we'd hoped. <laughs> now die, fool! I am your doom! I am your end! And when you are slain, all blood will... <laughs> Evil God, once again shattered by our suit's mighty. Her Biden's flanky claims. Go on, it's yours now. Didn't he say his curse, though? Yep, now it's your curse. Oh, great. Wait, are we really stuck with this cursed Biden thing? I don't like that. Nah, you can just sell it. That is, if you don't care about keeping Celissa from getting all her big bad powers back and drowning the world or whatever. Not particularly, no. Eh? And you do you, baby. Now, descend to the eternal wellspring slash throne room to meet your adoring public. Let's hear it for the hero of Sunfang Oasis! Yeah! <laughs> Thank you for ridding us of the corrupting influence of Celissa. Many of our sisters will still be in an unbridled fury, but some of us have been saved that fate. Thanks to you, you have our gratitude. 